Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Katherine Burgess, and today we're gonna do a full cut crease, not a half cut crease, but a full one. We're gonna do it. And I'm using this e.l.f. little strips. They cost about, I believe, one dollar or two dollars just to help me with this look. And we're gonna start off by using the James Charles palette. I'm jumping right in with this purple shade. I'm gonna put that on the outer corner of my eye. I'm gonna use the tape to kind of help me know where I should stop at. Then jumping in with the pink, I'm gonna start blending the pink into the purple and that's gonna go also in the middle of my eye. Then lastly, taking this darker orange shade that's going to go in my inner corner. I'm also going to be blending that into the pink. Then I'm going to take this little tiny blending brush by Morphe and I'm going to start off with the purple. I'm going to take this lighter purple shade and that's going to help me blend out the purple. I'm going to go on top of that color and kind of like smoke it out also. Then I'm going in with the same pink shade that we used. There is a lighter pink shade, but I don't really like it. Like I feel like it doesn't have that much pigment, like it doesn't do anything. So I'm just gonna go ahead and use the same shade and just blend it a little bit higher. Then I'm taking this light orange shade to blend out the darker orange shade. There's something about this shade that I love so much. I feel like I use it in every single one of my looks. And you also kind of want to go back into each one of the colors and intensify it. So just basically go back and blend and rebuild and blend and rebuild. And once that's done, I'm going to go in with my e.l.f. 16 hour camo in the shade medium sand. And I'm going to use that to cut out the full cut crease. I'm gonna go ahead and take a flat shader brush and that's just gonna help me take out any excess concealer and just make it dry. So while that concealer is drying down, I went ahead and did the other eye off camera and now they're both dried. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this white shade from that palette and I'm gonna use that to set the concealer. Then going in with a very small little tiny liner brush, I think it's what it originally is. I'm going to go in with those three colors and I'm going to start making a wing. I'm going to start off with the purple, then move to the pink and then the orange. And once I have that all set, I'm going to go ahead and remove the little tape. 
and that helps so much i hate doing wing liner it's not my favorite which is why it's never in my looks so the tape really helped a lot then i'm gonna go ahead and do the same thing to my other eye I went ahead and did my face off camera and here it is now the last thing we need to do is just work on the bottom lash line i'm taking this fluffier brush by it's my ray ray collection and i'm going in with those three colors again and i'm just gonna run them on my bottom lash line Then all I needed was some falsies, so I went ahead and did that off camera, and that completed the look. Thank you guys for watching, and please subscribe if you guys want to see more looks like this.